Hi, this is Joe, and thanks for coming back for another video. I just purchased a Tile Mate, which is a Bluetooth tracking device. There's just as a note, there's three of them the Mate, the Sticker, and the Slim. All come with non replaceable batteries. Uh, I paid right around $25 for the Mate. Uh, I spoke to customer service and they gave me a lot of information, so I'll be passing that on, along to you. They have a, a premium membership, uh, 20, $30 a year approximately, or $2.99 a month, and you get a reimbursement for a lost device for up to $100. They then have a premium plan, which is $99.99 a year, or right, right at $100 a year, or $833 a month. And that's $1,000 reimbursement for a lost item. The Tile device has an application that works for both Android or Apple iPhone. So you can just download the appropriate app and install it on your phone. I've also linked it in with the Alexa app. So I'll be giving a demonstration on how that works with the Alexa app. You have to have the device within range of Bluetooth for it to work. Uh, they claim that it's up to 250 feet of Bluetooth range. Uh, they say up to three-year non-replaceable battery, even though on the warranty card it says one year. I have a video of me trying to find my pet and tried to uh, determine just what kind of range I could get with Bluetooth. Tile indicates that it does support Amazon Sidewalk which is a service which uh, shares a tiny portion of everyone's uh, Wi-Fi network in the neighborhood. But in asking customer support if it increased the range any, they said no, the device has to be within range of Bluetooth. So let's take a look at the video I created and I'll give you some of my feedback on what I think of this device. The only difference I can tell between the subscription service and the non-subscription service is you get 30 days of, of location history and you get the reimbursement of either $100 or $1,000. Other than that, uh, I don't see much difference. When you press the Find button, it tries to locate the tracking device and it will then to try to determine the signal strength of whether it's a high, moderate, or low. And then it will also play a little ringtone on the tracking device so you can hear where the device is located if it's near you within uh, hearing range. When I first tried tracking the Tile device, I stayed in the house. I send my wife and the dog out to walk uh, about a block or so in front of the house because that's usually where the dog runs off to when she escapes. When my wife hit the sidewalk, I totally lost tracking uh, on the phone of where where that tile device was so it was basically unrecognizable when I kept on pressing the find button it wouldn't find anything and then it would stop so I literally had to walk out to the sidewalk and then uh, watch sort of in a line of sight fashion uh, where my wife was walking and you'll see here on the video that I keep on going back and hitting the find and then the location uh, to try to get the uh, get the location of the tracker and as you see in the video it doesn't move very much and after a short period of distance uh, it just the device was uh, sort of unresponsive on the map it did move a little bit in real time when I spoke with customer service, they did say that it really doesn't provide a, a real-time tracking. So that's why I kept on refreshing the location to see if I could see uh, the location change of, of where my wife was with the dog. My wife walked further up the street, and we've totally lost the signal on the tracker. Uh, as you can see, it says notify when found. So I had her uh, turn around and try to come back and... Again, keep on hitting the find button and location history to try to, to uh, get the device to recognize uh, or get the signal on the device to uh, be found by the phone app. Uh, it took a while uh, for that to happen. And what I found overall is 
my wife could not go very far up or down the street. And again, I'm standing right on the sidewalk watching her walk up and down the street. And go maybe 25, 50 feet, and then we'd lose signal on the uh, tracking device. All in all, I wasn't too terribly pleased. Um, normally when my dog runs off, she goes up uh, possibly a block up and a block down um, before she comes back. So we definitely would lose the signal if my dog was uh, gallivanting around the neighborhood. So um, all in all, this would be a great tracking device for devices in your house, like if you're trying to find your keys or your phone. Uh, there is an option if you uh, link it into the Alexa app that you can say, uh, find my phone or find the, the name of the phone, and it will ring the phone. Uh, and I'll show you a video clip here of it actually working uh, with Alexa to locate uh, the actual tile tracker. Alexa. Find my tracker. Your tracker was last seen at 3.59 p.m. near 1,652 Baltimore PL. Should I ring tracker? Alexa, yes. Let me try to ring your tracker. 